Good morning and welcome to the Shilamuran grasslands here in Inner Mongolia in China. I'm up here with the sunrise, gonna fly the drone a little bit. It's only 6.18 here in the morning. Gonna wait for the others. Then we're gonna ride some horses and also go and hike up a volcano. It's gonna be a lot of driving today, but hopefully some nice nature. And then I'm going back to Beijing tonight, but it's been three pretty interesting days here. Hopefully it's gonna be some more cool stuff with food and landscapes along the way here. Yeah. We'll see where the day takes us, but looking forward to it. So for long and I will see you a bit later. Okay, so apparently it's time for horse riding now. Two hours, slightly longer than I thought, slightly chillier. Good, I brought this one. Let's go in here, listen to the instruction and let's get going. Okay, so we got a very fashionable helmet and ready to go. Safety first. Good stuff. Oh, yeah, so we're on the horse now, ready to go exploring. No fun, but we'll see. It's gonna be quite an adventure, I'm sure. A little bit of a horse riding going on here. Yeah. Nice, relaxing morning. Time for a bit of a break, yeah. Quite a nice way to start the morning in the open landscapes. Not fantastic clear skies, but still very nice. First time I think I've been on a horse ride like this. Really cool and nice environment, that's for sure. Quite interesting walk here out on the grasslands. We're gonna walk to Volcano. I'm not sure if it's now or later, but pretty cool to see a bit of the nature. Oh, here we got some wildlife, we got some rabbits here. Interesting stuff going on in the middle of nowhere. Nice little local cool hut here. Some snacks going on. Here we get a bit of a local snack situation going on. Some yuck milk, I think. <laughs> Have some more of this nice meat here. Very nice for the dry beef. Really good stuff, this dried mm -hmm. beef. Got the spicy one here. We have some of these dried nice yogurt snacks. Great stuff. Yeah, definitely getting these two. Great for the snack in the car later. Go to a nice little small river here in the middle of nowhere. I think now it's time to ride back. Get back into the warm places again. Yeah, it was a pretty cool start to the morning. Now we're back into the base camp. I think next up is the volcano. Nice. Seems like this bus ride taking slightly longer than we thought. It was supposed to be two hours. And now it's been two hours. We have another two hours to go. So I'm having a bit of a break. We're with a healthy apple snack here. Out enjoying the nature. It's actually really beautiful. You have all the colors changing in the background. And these like farms, fields and Actually, a little nice mountain and changing environment, and then we're going to continue towards the volcano. It's supposed to be more flat, just showing some of the clips here in the background. So, I don't mind actually. I think it's really nice to go on these road trips, especially if you're not sleeping, so you actually see stuff in the background. I've been quite a few on these two, like Sichuan and Xinjiang, Yunnan. I think one of the best part of that is actually just relaxing, taking these amazing views, and walking around, having a bit of a break. and hike because that's what i'm going to do after this i'm just gonna continue having a little bit of nice break here then i guess it's another two hours until we get to the volcano have lunch it seems hike a bit and then go back to beijing but no problem very very nice if you like nature which i do so see you a bit later yeah after a very bumpy ride we stopped and found a bit of a nice restroom shed here in the background uh, interesting uh, facilities you have an offer Really beautiful nature with all the colors in the background, that's for sure. Soon we're gonna arrive at the volcano here in like 20 minutes, but first a bit of a break, so time to move. After a very long drive, finally we arrived at the restaurant here. Apparently not so long time to sit down and enjoy it, but I'm sure it's gonna be some good food. Hopefully I can show it in the background anyway. Let's see. Here we go, the food, nice. Oh, a lot of good stuff here. Interesting, we get a bit of a top. Let's enjoy it. Nice and good protein. Some fantastic vegetables as well. Mm. Fantastic piece here of pork, bacon, and pepper. Nice crispy cauliflower. Again, definitely one of my long time favorites here. Mm. Also good potatoes. Mm. There's actually a huge piece of nice pork. You can see all the fat here. Amazing, not healthy, but amazing. Mm. That way, out on the road, you have to be innovative. Bring your own coffee here. Mix with a nice here. Bit different, normally. Nice. Fantastic, so after a lot of driving through this pretty interesting and beautiful landscape, after that lunch, we arrived to this volcano in the background. Gonna walk up the steps a bit here, get the stamina, stamina upgrade to get the pulse up and 
use up that energy from the food. Let's get going and climb up and see the what's on the top. Selling some nice local food here as well. I think I'm gonna wait until later. Looks nice. You could pick the stairs or this more sandy path. And of course, we're taking the hard one. We put some stairs here and then for safety. Great to get up the pulse a little bit, as I mentioned, so you wake up. Fantastic, I have a lot of energy from the coffee and a lot of good food as well. Look at that background, it's amazing. Whew, now at the top, let's bring up the drone, see if we can get some nice shots. Wow, really cool, when you get to the top, you can see down here in the crater in the background, crazy, and then you just turn around and you have this beautiful and vast landscape with the grasslands. Amazing, you can see like a 360 view here. Whew, definitely worth walking up here. Yeah, that was definitely a very successful hack up this volcano. We have this beautiful sunset in the background. Definitely worthwhile walking up for. Now we're gonna continue driving. I think we're gonna pass by another volcano, but not walk up. But worthwhile to come all the way here, that's for sure. If you have the time to pass by, certainly recommended. But now I'm gonna walk down the stairs here. So see you on the next stop, see what that is. Nice, we got to the next volcano here. Number six, apparently. There are quite a bunch here when you pass away. Very beautiful in the background and the sunset, I think. Definitely the best timing here. You can see all the nice colors in the background. I don't think we're gonna walk up on this one, just check it out, but really nice to see some cool views here in the background. Apparently it looks like a spaceship. I'm not totally convinced, but you can rent some space suits here if you wanna take a photo. Quite interesting how you come up with these ideas, but let's go up. Yeah, the small stairs and check it out. What a fantastic ending to this Inner Mongolia adventure here. Windy with this black volcano in the background called the Spaceship. Really fantastic. But now, gonna head back to the train station, go to Beijing. It's gonna take in this beautiful sight here in the background. Head there, hope we make it on time. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you wanna see more of this kind of stuff, of course, give me a like, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.